what is up guys it is an example coming to you today with a brand new video that sounds weird because I don't say that but today I'm gonna be explaining why I hate parks in this story time episode number two so stick around and intro What the hell? Since when is there a fucking spaceship in this fuck? What? So let me tell you another story about a fucking park. So, you know, that age you get to. Oh, yeah, I apologize for the cars outside and stuff. But you know that age when you like feel grown enough and you start going outside and you like want to hang out with your friends and all that? So I got to that age, right? And I used to every day after school, like, Mom, I'm going to the park. So I used to go to the park with my friends all the time. Well, friends? I don't know. I don't talk to none of them anymore. So I remember this one day, we we used to always play this thing called um, punch ball, which is basically baseball without a bat and without the really hard ball. So we used to play that all the time. And I don't know how old I was. It was around the same age when I got punched by the fucking bitch. And this kid that I used to see at school, well, he wasn't at, was he at my school? I don't remember. So apparently he wanted to play with us. And I don't know. I don't remember what I said. But I may or may not have said something that offended him or something. So basically he got angry, right? And so... <laughs> and so when I said no to him, he gets angry. He's like, all right, kid, fuck you. I'm going to come back in a few minutes. I don't remember what he said. He just like cursed me out. And I was like, okay, whatever. He's going to come back or something. <laughs> Like five minutes later, I see him come back with like 10 people. Well, like, you know, we were small, but you know, when you're young and still, you still get fucking scared. So I'm like, oh shit, these fucking 10 year olds are coming after me. But, you know, I was the same age, so it was like, so now I see a group of 10 year olds, just like, get the fuck out of here, you little ass kids. So as they're getting closer to the field, I'm like, okay, guys, I'm leaving. And then, um, fucking. I start walking, and I remember I had this like long sleeve sweater. I don't know why I remember that, but so I start walking away, and like, yo, where you going? And I'm like, oh shit! So I start running, <laughs> and they start fucking chasing after me to get to that park. You have to go past this street where there's like a bunch of factories and stuff. So I'm running past there, yo. I don't understand how the hell I was running so fast. I guess there was the adrenaline or something, but I was running so fast. And I remember looking back and seeing them like spread out into like different streets in case I crossed the street. Yo, they were doing some tactical shit, man. I don't know. But I just remember running, running, running. And so you know what ended up happening? There used to be this video store where you'd like rent movies and stuff. So I went in there. He knows me. I was like, yo, I'm gonna go in the back room because they're chasing me. He's like, okay. He didn't even ask questions. He was like, okay. So I go in there, I'm hiding. And then these kids come in, right? I don't know why my dumb ass decided to come out. And so <laughs> I open the door and like two of them are in the store and then they see me so they come up to me and they're like come what the fuck did they say they said something like come outside kid I'm gonna fuck you up or something like that I'm like oh shit oh shit oh shit I'm gonna get fucked up so I was like okay so I'm like inside fucking <gasps> dying from running so much because you fucking fat ass kid and shit running my life out so you know what happened it's funny because so as soon as I'm about to run out my friend comes in oh fucking boss in the background so as soon as I'm about to run out my fucking friend comes in oh my bad I wasn't even in the lobby because <laughs> I'm like so into the story so well, as soon as I'm about to run out my friend comes in and he comes in with like five other kids and I'm like oh shit he's like he was like, yo, I saw you running, son. What the fuck happened? I was like, I don't know. These kids want to jump me and shit. He's like, son, don't worry about it. We're going to take you home. Because his friends were like older. And her cousin, well, it was, a, it was a girl. But, you know, she was like really old. And so he's like, don't worry about it, son. We got you. I was like, oh, shit. I was like, thank you. So I woke up with them. And the fucking group of kids is like run, walking around us across the street. I'm like, oh, shit. Oh, shit. But, yeah. So they ended up walking me home 
fun. Every it's like it seems like every time I go to the park, I have a bad experience, man. I don't know, but that's one thing. Fucking parks, man. And you know it's funny. After that day, every time that that kid sees me, he always wants to fight me. Like, even now, he, he probably if, if, whoa, fuck, I like confuse my own words. Even now, if he probably sees me, he probably want to fight me. Even though like I moved from that area, so I haven't seen them in like years. But yeah, he probably still wants to beat me up. <laughs> Cause I didn't let him play punchable, man. God damn it. That was it. I hope you guys enjoyed my story. Whew! <coughs> I talk too much, man. My fucking throat hurts. But yeah, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. By the way, I'm sorry for the horrible gameplay. It's like really hard to concentrate on the game while you speak. So I'm really sorry. Like I just noticed. I just fucking jumped off the map. <laughs> but anyways, guys. It's been an example. I'll catch you later. See ya.